What's up, YouTube? Subscribe to me. I'm back again. Uh, I just want to make another video kind of quickly. Uh, go over a few things that I think I've learned so far in the uh, my journey, my freeform journey. Um, some things to think about if you're considering starting freeform locks. Um, it's kind of a little bit of motivation. Um, I want to do a quick shout out first though to Lasan Jones. Um, it's a guy that I watched a couple times before I started my locks. Uh, he hit me up on my last video, my first video. Uh, you know, kind of encouraging me and check out his videos. He's really encouraging. He's got a lot of good things to say about staying locked, getting the motivation to stay locked. Uh, so check him out. Basically, I want to make this video so that you guys understand kind of a bit of the challenges of freeforming your locks, especially socially. Uh, for me, I work in an area, I work kind of uh, in a corporate environment. I'm not suit and tie or anything like that. I'm um, somebody on the ground floor, but I get a lot of judgment, especially from people that I work with uh, that aren't really all that supportive of my hair, of my crown, of uh, kind of why the reasons why I'm trying to do uh, locks. And especially the free form, they think it look, I look homeless. I get homeless a lot, um, ugly, dirty, you know, uh, that kind of stuff. And it's all stuff that can be really demotivational. Don't listen to those people. If you've got people like that in your life that are saying that kind of stuff, don't listen to them. They're not your friends anyways. Uh, and they will probably find a way to make fun of you no matter what. Uh, but especially when you're doing locks, man, you can't listen to anybody. It's your hair, it's your body, it's what you want to do. Uh, and if you're doing locks uh, to please people, then you're not doing them for the right reasons. To me, the reason why I started locks is because I like them, but also because I wanted something to teach me real patience. And locks is all about patience. Locking your hair is a is a, a journey, a process. I know you've heard that probably a million times from a bunch of other people, but it seriously is. And if you don't have locks, you wouldn't know. But it's a it's a journey. It's something that you start and you have to see it through to the other end. You have to be patient. You know, it's like a little kid. They grow, they mature, they get different. And you know, before long, you're looking back and you're like, man, can't believe they ever looked like that to begin with. They're come 100% different. You know. Um, but just be motivated to stay locked. You know, don't cut your hair off. I've, I've thought about it before, not with my this set, but with the set before that that I twisted that didn't end up the way I wanted them to. I thought about cutting them and cutting my entire hair off. And that's like, you know, over a year of growth gone down the tube for me. That would have really sucked. So don't do that. Even if you feel like they look ugly right now, it's a stage. You know, this too will pass. It's just a stage. Don't worry about it. It'll go away. They'll get longer or they'll fall down. They'll do what you want them to do but really embrace it. Every part of the lock journey is different. Um, the other thing that I would say is, is there are people who will, I've noticed, will try to avoid talking to me because uh, I do security and people will want, not want to ask direction from me because of the way I look now. You know, I've got my tattoos, uh, I've got my locks and they, they, I don't know if they just think a certain type of way about me, but oh well, you know, it's, this is what I wanted to do. And this is kind of the look that I like. It's something that I'm comfortable with. I love my hair. I wouldn't trade my hair for anything. Uh, I love the messiness, the frizziness, the ugliness, you know, the dirtiness, whatever. Uh, that's me, you know, and it's going to become part of your personality. It's just something you got to be motivated to, to stay doing. Uh, but don't let anybody demotivate you. You know, this is your hair. This is the decision you made. You got to stick with that decision because you're going to regret it. You know, when you watch other people that are going on in the journey, getting further along as their hair starts to get real cool or their hair starts to get to a point that you would set as a goal for yourself and you're going to be disappointed if you cut your hair off or if you stop locking them you brush them out uh that you didn't go any further that you gave up and you're going to kind of feel like you failed um so just stay with it it's all right if it's ugly now it'll be beautiful later and if it's not beautiful later just keep waiting it'll get there you know everything is time with locks all right but anyways i don't want to ramble like I said, I want to thank Lasan Jones, uh, a lot of the other people in the lock community for watching these videos, uh, supporting each other. Uh, that's the big thing, man. Everybody has a lot of support on YouTube, and I didn't really realize that. I just used to watch the videos, never go down in the comments, really comment on anything. Uh, but as I can see, man, even with a lot of the smaller guys, people that are only putting up a couple of videos, you know, every month, uh, a lot of people are watching them. They're really supportive. They're really, you know, helpful. Uh, you know, offering a lot of advice. So if you're thinking about starting locks, uh, you know, watch some of these videos, get in the comments, ask questions, ask us. I know that a lot of the guys that put out these videos, a lot of the YouTubers there, we put out, you know, we'll, we'll answer you and we'll try to help you out as best as we can because we were where you were at at one point. 
I'm not even that far in, but I guarantee you, I've learned a few things. You know, in my update, my two month update, I'm gonna get into it. I've learned a few things, uh, a few things to avoid, some things uh, to do, you know. Uh, but anyways, guys, thanks for watching the video. Uh, my two month update will be coming soon. I think like next week or the week after. I, I'm not sure, I'm gonna have to look when I uploaded that last one. I'm not good with time. Uh, but stay locked, you know, stay courageous. I'll see you next time.